hello cancers welcome back to queen cancer tarot channel this is part two for cancers and sagittarius i'm sorry that initial reading got cut off there you guys um but i didn't go any further it fortunately it beat at me uh when it cut off so we stopped right here when the devil in the reverse came out cancer and this talks about someone who's coming in to reclaim their power um, this talks about someone who is independent or single, very much single cancer, um, you know, and they're now coming back in to take their place, cancer. Um, and let's find out who this energy is here. Underneath the deck, you have the star cancer, and this is someone who's very much looking to heal something and look. Look at here, under the deck, you have the Nine of Pentacles and the Star. This is someone who is single, Cancer. The Nine of Pentacles represents someone who is um, living their best life, Cancer, um, who has been doing them at this point. Definitely someone who is coming in a very single, very independent energy. us about this Knight of Cups, please. Holy Spirit, angels, and gods. Ooh, too many cards came out, Cancer. Mm. Too many cards came out. Tell us about this Knight of Cups, please, for Cancer, please. Okay. And we have the Six of Wands. You know, this person is coming in with a very flirtatious energy, Cancer, because they want to um, win something. This person has an ego. And with the Empress here, this person is trying to win over this Empress. I feel like this is your person coming back in, Cancer. So listen. So I feel like your person is coming back and trying to win you over, but you are, you're focused on doing you. Once you learned the truth about this person, you leveled up and you did something to yourself, Cancer, to where you, you, you leveled up, you glowed up, Cancer. And I feel like your star is a little bit too bright for this person. Underneath the deck here, we have the star. That was the next card here after this Eight of Pentacles. And I wasn't going to pull it out, Cancer. I'm going to go ahead and, and pull this card here. Because, listen, I feel like when you glowed up, whatever you did here, Cancer, you started to shine. You started to shine. And um, your person saw that. I don't know if it was online, Cancer. I keep getting the Page of Swords. I also got the Page of Swords here, but I feel like this person saw you, Cancer, and they couldn't resist reaching out to you. Tell us about the chariot, please. But you were living your best life. You were doing what was best for you. With the Lovers and the Two of Swords, Cancer, this talks about uh, a very strong soul tie connection here but with the two of swords someone has made a choice cancer to cut someone out and with the ace of swords cancer like you're finding out a truth and you are no longer sticking with this person but you're going off to do what's best for you okay under the deck seven of wands see what i mean like you're standing your ground and doing what's best for you, Cancer. Tell us about the Ace of Swords. Ooh. And we have the King of Swords, Cancer. 
So, like, you found out this person was going back and forth between you and another person underneath the deck, the Nine of Wands. And this was just, this was too much for you, Cancer. It was too much work for you. And you decided to go and, like I said, do what's best for you here. Tell us about the Eight of Pentacles, please. Holy Spirit. And we have the Ace of Pentacles, Cancer. And that's Nine Pentacles, Pre-Empress Energy. Like I said, you went to go work on you, honey. You went to go do what's best for you, honey. And you glowed up in the Sag, saw your light here shining so bright. Underneath the deck, look at the Strength card here, Leo Energy. You went to do what was best for you, Cancer. You went after a new opportunity, Cancer, that was going to um, help you, Cancer. And this is what happened. Tell us about the star card, please. And look, the Eight of Wands. Look at that. Sudden change, Cancer. This talks about a lot of communication moving coming in, somebody coming in wanting to heal things, Cancer. What are you going to do when the Sag comes back in under the deck? Ooh, Eight of Swords. Eight of Swords, Cancer. This talks about blocking somebody. Somebody being blocked, Cancer, not able to speak to you. Not able to come your way. Let's see what happens in the extended we are going to see what the challenges are um, i'm going to go ahead and pull three cards this is the challenge cancer we will uh, clarify this when we get into the extended tell us about cancer and sagittarius so we have the king of wands the hermit and the queen of cups cancer <laughs> Let's look underneath the deck here. The devil to the king of wands. We have the nine of wands to the hermit. And we have the nine of swords to that queen of cups. Let's take it into the extended. Let's go into a little more detail to clarify this energy and uh, talk about what all this means. We're going to look at the challenges What's going to happen? What are you going to do when the Sag comes back in? Are you going to accept what they have to say? Are you going to believe them, Cancer, if you choose to? What is going to happen if you walk away? What is the final outcome for you in the Sagittarius? In the extended, I will see you guys there. We will also pull uh, some heavy oracle in the extended as well, Cancers. I will see you all there. The link for the extended is in the description box below. It is a very low rate, so make sure you click on that just to check it out and see what it's all about. And if you decide to um, purchase the extended, I promise you it will definitely be worth your while. I'll see you all over there. Bye.